We want to talk about generation gap today. As you know, uh, a generation gap is the difference in attitude and behavior between uh, successive and different generation. Uh, both the uh, old generation and young generation always uh, accuse uh, each other uh, to being, uh, for example, old generation accused uh, the young generation for being disobedient and for lack in lacking in values. And at the same time, young generation usually accuse the old generation for being rigid and uh, for being outdated. Um, when we, we study the history, we noticed that uh, this problem started uh, from uh, industrial revolution. In the medieval uh, uh, society, there was no such kind of problem because at that time, usually the son bones uh, to choose the father's professions and continue uh, with that profession. And uh, usually there was no any uh, new challenges in society and always there was the uh, uh, same thing uh, in the society as before. For example, in 14th century or 15th century, the society and their problems was the same as before. And uh, um, the father at that time was the person who know everything and uh, he, who uh, knew that the uh, that his sons was challenging with uh, dilemmas and uh, with difficulties that he was uh, faced with that difficulties uh, before in his life. And uh, because of that, the difference between generation is usually not as much as we have uh, today. But uh, with the beginning of industrial revolution, everything changes. And uh, with uh, each uh, passing years, this gap uh, make appears, uh, make, uh, make appear. And uh, it all started uh, uh, when the mass media concentrated on producing uh, these changes, uh, producing uh, uh, the massive changes in social environment. For example, we can mention that uh, every 20 years, uh, the food, the music, uh, the dress in uh, different uh, uh, changes between generations. Uh, comparing to last uh, century, uh, last centuries, uh, fathers and sons were separated from each other. Uh, this father have different lifestyle from his son and the father uh, didn't, uh, don't know, uh, doesn't know the uh, solution for every problems or dilemmas that his son uh, face today. And uh, because of that, uh, they uh, gradually uh, make uh, wider between new, uh, different generations. Son would uh, look uh, elsewhere, elsewhere from his family or his father for answer that he look. And the, the father uh, wants him to listen to uh, uh, to his father, but and it, this cause uh, the uh, conflict between uh, the old generation and the new generation. Today, comparing to the uh, previous uh, centuries, uh, uh, the pace of change uh, become faster. Every day, new in, in new. Uh, problems or new technologies uh, appears, and uh, even the next, the new generation and old generation have used a different kind of language and slangs in their communication. Even 
maybe uh, the families, the father and the mother didn't understand the exact slang on languages that their uh, child used these days. And it maybe we could find uh, that uh, uh, the um, new generation use uh, 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 technologies that their uh, uh, parents uh, uh, don't uh, uh, be familiar with them enough. And uh, maybe even uh, the parents uh, prefer to communicate, for example, with uh, common type of writing, but the new generation prefers to use email or uh, a smartphone for uh, communication with each other. And uh, more than that, as I mentioned, use uh, different kind of language and sl slangs that their parents didn't uh, be familiar with them. Um, in the West, uh, they called uh, different, they have uh, different uh, ex expressions or names for different uh, type of generation. For example, they use uh, these uh, words for different generation, like silent generation, baby, baby boomers, uh, generation X, millennial, generation Z, and uh, all of them refer to different uh, type of generations according to uh, which years they birth and uh, the type of personality that they have. For example, the greatest generation or GI generation are those persons that uh, uh, live uh, before the 1924 and uh, they birth. Uh, uh, before 1924, and uh, they live through the World War II with uh, uh, the uh, hardship of the, that time. And uh, we also, the silent generation uh, live uh, between uh, births uh, uh, between 1925 and 1945. They uh, 